Hi everyone, first of all, I'm warm welcome to Navinas Mass YouTube channel, a group of CBS Institute. In this video, I'm going to explain a very important topic in uh, quantitative studies, time and work. Already, I recorded two lessons, lesson one, lesson two for Telugu medium background student. So you can watch from Telugu medium playlist. But this video is compatible for English medium background student. This is an introduction class of time and work in English medium. Okay, why are you waiting? Let's get into the topic of time and work. So before digging into topic, we need to uh, learn some basic concept that concepts are very helpful to solve a question in a, a smart method so first of all what is mean by work work means what to do something to do something means what consumption of time like uh, reading a book playing cricket or watching a movie or uh, having a time pass so nothing but all are having a consumption of time so consumption of time uh, named as a uh, uh, work so work depend on their consumption of time and time depend on their efficiency if person having high efficiency he consume less time Time to finish a particular work if person having high efficiency take a less time okay if person having less efficiency going to take a more time to finish a particular work so basically work depend on the two parameter time and efficiency but the major parameter of work is efficiency so therefore work is equal to a productive rule of efficiency and a time so the value which is lies on left side is basically result as per mathematical representation the values which is right side of the equal to is named as a production values if production values having product symbol if production values having product symbol if the result is constant stand the production values are inversely each other okay inversely each other here efficiency and time are which proportion inversely proportion means what uh, time is depend on the efficiency part so if you wanted to estimate a time before that you have to estimate efficiency so therefore efficiency is the first part so time depend on efficiency therefore we have some conclusion what conclusion is so don't try to add subtract division and multiplication of a different time if you want to do primary operation and uh, uh, time and work, you take uh, you need to take an efficiency or a work. So nothing but what you can add different efficiency. You can subtract one efficiency from other efficiency. You can multiply one efficiency to other. You can divide one efficiency from other also and a possible. Uh, similarly, you can do also addition of work is possible. Different uh, work, difference of work possible. Multiplication of work possible. Division of work also possible. But time it is not possible. Okay. So therefore, work is equal to efficiency to time this is a crucial concept the first concept of time and work this is very important and work is equal to efficiency into time we already learned so therefore if you want time work by efficiency if you want efficiency work by time so this is a fundamental tool in a, a time and work question so here time is an increasing function time is a increasing function therefore if well defined time is available we can use lcm concept basically time function is an increasing function so when we have an increasing function we're going to apply a equation method that is called an lcm least common multiple because multiple stands for increasing function so you can use lcm method to answer of a time and work question at least 90 percent of question we can solve from lcm but 10 percent of question is not possible though type of 10% are not having the a proper a time so they're having a disturbance of means a middle in and middle out time in that case as we're going to use a, a two more concepts that concept I'm going to explain in upcoming lessons okay now this is a base concept now we're going to discuss about some similar question on this concept which are a previous year question also let's get into the first question of the topic the first question it is a and B complete work in 20 and 30 days with help of C they complete work in a nine days Okay, with the help of C, they complete work in 9 days. Find the efficiency ratio of A, B, and C. This is a previous question. So basically, in a traditional method, we're going to find C individual time. That is time taking process. So basically, all uh, the beginners are followed this method A, B, C. Nothing but what, uh, uh, what does A, B, C complete work in home and 1 by 9? And what is the A value? 1 by 20. Okay. So 1 by 20 and 1 by 30, C value is 1 by C. This is a, a lengthy process to find a C value. It is time taking. Okay. So just for it about this method and traditional concept. Okay. You can go for our concept. Okay. What does this? So here it is. We A take home and days to complete work and 20 and B take home and days to complete work in 30. So C, we don't have any discussion mark. 
but a plus b plus c complete work in how many days nine days so we're going to use an lcm concept okay lcm concept the first uh, important query why we use lcm concept lcm stands for least common multiple multiple is nothing but word uh, indication of increasing so any function having increasing method definitely we're going to use a uh, equation method is called an lcm so time here time is an increasing function it is always a uh, uh, follow an increasing method let's uh, take an example of your age age is increasing function okay so time days hours minutes seconds all are an increasing method function so increasing method function follow lcm concept multiple means what increase that's why we use an lcm so this is lcm is nothing but what total work what is lcm of 20 30 and 9 it is nothing but what it is uh, so it is uh, 180 what is this 180 so what is the lcm of 20 39 is how much 180 so 20 how many times to get it is nine times and 30 how many times to get it is six times and 90 how many times to get it is 20 times okay therefore so a efficiency is how many parts nine parts and b efficiency is how many parts six parts but all three efficiency how many parts 20 parts so 9 plus 6 is 15 so how much to get in 20 five parts to get a 50 so therefore what is the efficiency ratio of a b c is 9 is to 6 is to 5 so this is a simple method to find an efficiency no need to follow the traditional method to address about uh, efficiency so if you follow traditional method first of all you have to find a c value then after you are going to find about an efficiency okay here the simple method why we use lcm means lcm stands for least common multiple multiple means what increasing if any function having increasing method we're going to apply lcm concept okay so in zone of lcm i'm going to explain you a complete uh, 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 methodology of lcm and hcf so don't worry that video i'm going to probably very shortly okay what is lcm of 2039 is 180 20 table it how many times to get a 180 nine times in 30 it is six so a b c all of three them complete work in nine days means what what is the total efficiency at 20 so how you notice this is efficiency because this is work efficiency is equal to i already told you what is this work by time so what is a work 180 units what is the time 20 days 180 divided by 20 what is this 9 9 is nothing but what efficiency what is the work 180 180 done by how many days 30 days what is a per day unit 6 units per day and what about an or abc per day they complete 20 units okay so nothing but what already we have a is 9 and b is a 6 9 plus 6 summing is how much 15 but how much value left over to complete 20 5 value left over to complete 20 therefore the 5 is called a, a c value so this is a method to answer a different type of question so if it all if it is how many days c alone to complete means what when 180 divided by 5 so nothing but what 36 so how many days C alone to complete a work? 36 days alone C alone to complete a work. So this is method to answer efficiency ratio. So you already have a clear idea why we use it on LCM. So why we use it LCM? LCM stands for least common multiple. Multiple indication is nothing but what increasing methodology. So when we have an increasing methodology in a particular functions, we're going to apply LCM questions. Okay, this is the first question. Let's go for the second question also. Okay. Let's get into next question on time and work. So four times of A work is equal to five times of B work comma three times of C work. If three of them A, B, C completed work in 24 days, how many days B alone to completed? Here the representative total work compared from A to B and A to C also. Comparisons only uh, uh, compared, uh, compared nothing but what fraction or ratio. So nothing but a subproduct. So that will apply on efficiency. Okay. In this question, he does the efficiency. What is four times of A is equal to five times of B? A first parameter and second one four times of a is equal to three times of c now here it is a by b is equal to how much it is five by four here and a by c is equal to how much it is three by four <coughs> here a value equal to five here a value equal to three so we need to uh, equal of a value it is multiplied by three times and this also three times and this is five times and this is five times therefore what is the efficiency of a b c is a is 15 and b is 12 and c is how much 20 okay clear what is the efficiency ratio of abc 15 is to 12 is to 20 in this question is specifically mentioned all three of them complete work in home and days it is 24 days so here a three person time 
addressed. So 3% time is amount is 24. So nothing but what A, B, C. You can add their respective representative to efficiency. 15 plus 12, 27. 27 plus 20 is 47. Okay. Now the question is work done by A. The question is work done by whom? B alone. So what is the B efficiency? 12. 12 amount times 2 times. 47 to are how much? 94. Okay, so what is the final answer? 94. So B ln to complete work in how many days? 94 days. Okay, so here uh, work is equal to concept of work is equal to efficiency into time. This is a concept. Okay, work is equal to efficiency into time. What is efficiency? Three of them is 47. They complete how many? 24. Why we take it as 47? Because all three of them complete work in 24 days. Something but what? All three means what? Addition. What is addition of ABC efficiency is 47. Now 47 into 24. This is a total work units. 47 into 24 is a total units. And don't try to multiply this because it's time taking. And this units are work done by B alone. What is the B efficiency? 12. So we can divide efficiency. Okay. We can multiply efficiency. I already explained in a, a basic. Okay. That's why I divide efficiency. So 12 how many times to get at 24? 2 times. And 47 2 times is how much? 94. Okay. This is the answer. Let's get into next question. Let's discuss about next question. Ram and Sham to complete work in 15 and 25 days. With the help of Danu, they complete work in 5 days. How much percent of work completed by Ramo? How much percent of work completed by Ramo? Here it is. Percent of work means what? Multiplication and having a fraction. So, we need to find their efficiency. So, efficiency is the final answer to this question. Okay. So, Ram, Ram take how many days? Uh, 15 days and and Sham take how many days? Uh, 25 days. So we don't have a Danu. So Danu is question mark, but with help of Ram, Sham, and Danu. Ram, Sham, and Danu. So how many days? Uh, it is five days. Okay, clear? What is LCM? It is 75. 75 means what? 15 table and how much of value left out to get 75? Uh, five times. So how much it is? 3 times. And how much it is? 15 times. It's clear? Now, what is the total work? Total work is 75 parts is equal to how much? It is 15. So that the total efficiency is 15. Upon 15, Ram shared how many parts at a time? 5 parts. Percentage means how much? 100. 5. How many times to get 15? 3 times. 100 divided by 3 is nothing but what? 33.33% of work completed by Ram alone. Okay. How much percent of Ram shared in group of work? 33.33% of work shared. If the question is Danu, Danu means what total 15 upon 15, 5 and 3, 8 completed, how much left it is 7. So you can find it as 7 by 15. Percentage means what 100. Approximately it is 42 percent is etc. Okay. So if at all question uh, are related to for Danu, you can find this method. Okay. Percent of work means what uh, you can find efficiency. What is the total efficiency? 15. The total pass is 15. Upon 15, Ram can at a time shade of 5 units. So 5 upon 15 into 100, nothing but what? 33.33 percent of work completed. So in group of Ram, Sham and Danu, so Ram shared 33.33 percent of work it is. If it all Sham is nothing but what? 3 upon 15 to 100 is 20 percentage. If question is what is the percent of work shared by Sham is 20 percent. And what about it is of some 42 uh, like uh, 3 by uh, 2 by 3 percentage etc. Okay. So this is a question. This type of model is basically dependent on efficiency. Okay. Okay. That's all for today. So and the next topic I'm going to discuss about a very uh, important uh, high memory based question uh, which was held in uh, 2019 and 20 also. Okay. So I hope you enjoyed. So thanks for watching. If you like my work hit a bell icon and subscribe my channel. Thank you for watching.